Uh, the next email is uh, because we discussed um, Oreos last week. Okay. Um, this is an email from Mr. Oreo, and I'm going to read oh, this. Oh, that's really convenient that he listens to our podcast. Yeah. Hi, Mr. Oreo, how are uh, yeah. you? Um, I, I'm going to read this in my best... Uh, uh, Business voice? In my, in my best... Uh, 1950s instructional video voice. All right. Greetings from the office of Mr. Oreo. I am presenting to you the information for your del uh, delectation regarding your Oreo brand cookie biscuit treats fresh from the bakeries of Oreo Labs in Craft City. Having directly been orientated towards your delightful personal radio hosting show by a most concerned member of the public, I was excessively pleased to discover your friendly questions about the validity of Oreo marketing branding tactics <laughs> policies. This is particularly as is regarding the price of Oreo cookies and cream components I understand. <laughs> Please be equally understanding. I wish you to know that we are exceedingly egregiously respecting towards the veracity of our clients' taste buds. Without flourishment and in nourishment, how else will those totsome tongue buds bloom and grow to enjoy premium <laughs> next-gen Oreo products? Oh my god. How true. You must realize that all cookies are made in the same way. This is fundamentally true. This is undeniable. Were this not the case, then cookies would could not attain the e egalitarian nature in delivering moisturicity and and crunch strognomy toward the many adoring consummates of Oreo. <laughs> so it follows that henceforth and onwards, the Oreo cookies must be shortly cost existent to produce. This is the case. Howsoeverly, this is the case for all cookies globally, even those of non Oreonic creamiology. <laughs> this moves us neatly onto the issue of cream, which you enjoy. You may have noticed by now that the term cream is a misdescription, as the sugarized filling is indeed non creamular, but rather glutized sugar grade product. <laughs> Research indicates that this is what people want, and we surely deliver very much, yes. Furthermore, extra, you are provided with extra quantities of this premium white paste with our top-of-the-line plus stuffed sandwich of sugar crunch. <laughs> Progressitatively, I put this to you. Is it not possible to enjoy egalitarian cookies regardless of the number you consume? <laughs> Simply consume extra cookies if you feel you have not indulged sufficiently and adequately, and less if you have overstipulated your gestative capacity. The onus is not on cookie meisters to overstock the world with a surplusity of biscuit. <laughs> Yet the cream must flow. The cream <laughs> does flow. I robustly contend that there is no duplicity, or as you may perhaps wish it, triplicity in this industry. There is only the Oreo duopoly, cookies and cream. <laughs> Hastily contact me with further queries. Please and do buy more and thanks. Yours sincerely, Mr. Oreo. Cookies, excellent. Oreos of Oreo. P.S. <laughs> Please disregard my Gmail address, which I am flatulently drawing attention towards presently. Oh, how sharp you are. So sharp as whips. But please entrust <laughs> that not just anyone may use the Oreo name. And I am indeed a top biscuit, as we Americans say. Can you? All right. Shut it down. We're done. Can you, can you come live with us? 